Hello, today I'm going to show you two easy ways to create a Python program. The first one is simply going to a notepad or a simple text editor. And what I'm going to do is go to save as. I'm already in where I save all my Python files. And what I'm going to do is instead of saving a .txt file, I'm going to save it as .py. And I'm gonna call this one hello w. So I save it and well basically I've already created the program, but it's an empty program. So let's write some code. Simple print hello world. And we're gonna save it again to set the changes. And we're gonna run it through a terminal which I'm using Sequin. And first, I must go to the location of my file. To do so, I will use cd and write the whole path to my file location. And I'm going to hit enter. After that, I write python to tell it to run it with python and the name of my file, which I did save it as hello w.py. I'm going to run it. And there you go. It printed the hello world in the terminal. Now, this is one way, but Python automatically comes with the IDLE, which what it's going to be, it's the simple tool that lets you create programs a little bit easier. So I open a new file and I'm going to save as, go to programming, save it as hello wp.py so basically again I've already created my program but it's empty I'm gonna do the same program again um, go print hello world and run it you can go to menu run run module or just press f5 and it will tell you to save it you can save it before or whatever but we'll save it right now and it will run it in the console and there you go it prints hello world now this is this is just two ways to create files but you can run it either way basically what this means is that i can still go and open my hello w in the in the ideally and of course in the con in the terminal i can still open my hello wp with Python and it, it will run in both of them there is no problem it's just two different ways to create these files